Hello and welcome to the channel. This is your host, D-Day, bringing you Enigmatica 2 Expert Mode. If you're enjoying the series, please hit the like button, subscribe, and most importantly, leave a comment. Thank you so much, and enjoy the show. El Smeltorino. Smelt delicious. You down here, homie? Yeah. Where are you? Huh? Right behind you. You scared me. Oh here, uh. Did I really, Did I really scare you, or is that <clears> a no, fake? No, I'm, f I'm faking it, of course. Hold this. And that. And let me know when you get the quest dingers for both of those. Uh, one. And then can you give me the enderium back? <laughs> Do I keep the Terra Steel? Yeah, the two Terra Steel, and here's a full set of Quantum, baby. <gasps> oh my god. Cool, I got the Which, uh, where was that? What? Oh, I'm kidding, sorry. So you put that Quantum on, you have a jetpack now. Sweet! Wait, I'm not on stream yet, why are we doing this stuff? What? I'm not streaming yet. Oh, well, I'm recording and streaming already. I'm letting me claim. Alright. Okay. Ready? And... What's up everybody? It's Trim Fitted Abyss Gaming here. Uh, welcome back to another day of my life. Um, uh... Enigmatica 2. Boogaloo. Um, more astral sorcery. Mana steel. Mana glass. That's what it was. I'm so sorry. People watching me were probably like, how do you forget what you were doing? That's being me. Um, mana glass. So we'll be working on mana glass today through Tanya to continue an astral sorcery. But first, oh snap! That's a quantum suit. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, so what do I do with the terra steel? I am lagging pretty hard. I gave you two flints. Uh, uh -huh. The tool forge is right under the smell tree. Attach them to both of your picks. Oh, cool. This uh, fortified terra steel will let us mine on other planets. <laughs> oh, that, that is some cool stuffs right there. Okay, okay. And, then and then I can just put, put on my quantum <laughs> suit. Yeah. No, no helmet. helmet. Hmm? No, just no yeah. Put all of it on. Oh, oh there's a helmet. Hug, <laughs> Oh, they don't have my triple bounce. No, but you have a jetpack. And I charged the unit too. Oh my goodness, let's go! go! <laughs> and your boots, your boots absorb the damage, but at the cost of RF. So the it absorbs damage from the 10 million RF. You have to recharge the boots, though. How fast is it? Like it de down. depends on how far you fall from. You know, like the if it's like yeah. I hey, no more just like jump, jump. No, yeah. Break neck, jump, jump, break neck. Yeah. That's very exciting. Yep, yep. So yeah, like I usually I hit spacebar right before hitting the ground to buff it. You know, so that I don't hit the ground too hard. Uh-huh. And then uh, the durability of the boots don't go down that much. Uh, okay, okay, okay. So, like, when I'm falling, I just, like, falling. That, did it work? Did I? I don't know if I held it down long enough. And I am going to take down our induction oh, matrix. Okay, I'm sorry, but this looks cool as crap. Look at my screen. Oh, you like the outside of the building? Oh my, oh my gosh, gosh, it looks so, so cool with all the colors and different okay. things. I love, I love that. that. Oh, oh my goodness. goodness. That's, That's really, really cool. cool. It, it looks really, really, really good. Okay, okay I can't go in the door because I keep accidentally climbing up the walls. I might take off this climbing gear if it's going to be more annoying. Alright. Okay. okay. What do I need to do with my life? What am I... What am I doing? Here. What is left? Oh, I haven't seen the red dragon armor yet. Yeah, you see it? Oh, it looks really cool. Oh, that's my favorite one so far. I want to find a freaking blue dragon. I know. Like, We're going to have to scan for it. 
is this? What are you looking at? It's like, like dark, dark purple, purple armor. armor. Oh, that's tough alloy. Alloy? Oh, <laughs> sounds tough. <laughs> oh yeah, the legs. The, <laughs> the legs have sprint on them. Oh my gosh, it looks like I'm fast forwarding. Yeah, the legs have sprint on them, so when you sprint it uses RF for the legs. Oh my gosh. Oh, this one's cool. This is like a pink transformer. Yeah, the Psy armor. So, oh so like gosh, your this cleaver is the biggest cleaver I've ever seen. Oh, the Terra Steel. Wow. wow. So, like, yeah, the Quantum Boots have Feather Fall at the cost of RF. The legs have Super Sprint at the cost of RF. Wow. The chest has Jetpack at the cost of RF, and the helmet has Night Vision at the cost of RF. Night Vision. Word. Swiggity Spooty, man. Like, Swiggity Spooty. That's all I can say. All right. Uh, let me build one item real quick. I got it on Autocraft. I was going to make it like earlier today, but I went over an hour. So, Elite. I made the Elite Induction Provider. I need to make the Elite Induction Cell, one of them. And I have everything set to auto craft, and let's see how long it takes to build that. I love watching this thing go. You're loving your wow! Autograph? It needed over a hundred of those tablets to be made for this one item, and uh, one thing that's frustrating about those tablets is you have to make them one at a time. Like if you manually craft it, because it's one of those items that won't. Uh, What's what's it called? It won't. Man, I totally totally <laughs> slipped my mind. If you manually craft it, it's one of those manually items. like it. It won't like when you hit the plus button, it won't pull in. You know, into like it won't pull the items into the the crafting. So you have to manually place each one. Uh, I got stunted because. Uh, I don't know why it didn't finish the craft for the elite. Elite. Did you see the daisy? Elite That's induction. What I'm going on a for. Elite induction provider. Elite induction cell. I really feel like maybe one day I'll have one episode where I'm like actually prepared for what I'm doing. Maybe. What did this oh, thing just do? What did this thing just do? Okay. Down, because you don't actually fly very fast. Like the jetpack's good, but you need to do your sprint for traveling. What in? What the heck? For real though, it was it was auto crafting and then it stopped crafting, and then I tried to craft it again and it used up all of my materials. I'm, I've gotten I'm nauseous, nauseous from, from running too much. much. Elite induction provider, elite induction cell. Dude, that's not fair. Daisies. An oxide daisy, is that gonna count? Uh, no, probably not. Ugh. Dude, did it just eat all of my materials? I think it bugged out and it's Oh, that's right. It ate out all of my materials. Okay, I'm going to make it daytime if that's okay. Sure. Okay. So that's right. That's why I was trying to figure this out is because we're supposed to use petals. So I need more petals. I need more petals. 
Oh man, I hope it doesn't eat more of my materials. Um. <coughs> mystical white petal, white shimmering mushroom. Mystical white petal, white shimmering mushroom. Okay. Tall mystical white flowers. I think we have those. Tall. We have one. Let's see what happened. Mystical white flowers. Perfect. Okay. Those are the petals. Elite induction provider. Elite induction cell. Four, so probably eight is what I need. Okay. Let's go back to here. We can figure this out. Okay. Get here. One. My batania. I think it ate everything. Okay. Everything I needed to make the elite induction cell. It ate it all. That's a lot. A lot of materials it just ate. Elite induction Sorry. provider, elite induction cell. So eight as in went ahead and... And started crafting but then stopped and then didn't give me the item. Oh. Why is it doing this? Okay. Looks like I need to put... Am I missing... Advanced induction cell. Energy tablets. Basic induction cells. Energy tablet. Oh, maybe I only needed four. Basic induction cells. Energy tablets. Advanced energy cube. What should I do if I put too many in? What do you mean? Oh, oh. Yep. Okay. Doing things. Check the seeds. I need seeds. Sorting facility, please have seeds. See, like, why does it do that? What? It's not putting it together. The advanced induction cell. I'm actually doing a thing. I know that you are very frustrated right now, and I'm very sorry, but I actually did a thing, and I have a pure daisy, and I did it. Good job. Yes. Okay. okay, next step. That was just for living rock. Okay. So. Advanced induction. Let me see if. Read the Batania book actually for this. Your daisy to make living rock. I put a pure daisy by. Level stone. Okay. Hobble. Do I have any on me? I do have some on me. Wow. Okay, how much living rock do I need? Tablet. To make this, I need One. four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine. Let's see. Oh, elite induction provider, advanced induction cell. I pulled the wrong one. Elite induction provider, advanced. Oh, okay. I have my pure, pure daisy. Oh, I have my pure daisy going. Induction. We keep eating new foods, but I'm kind of focused. Provider. Okay. <clears throat> Leave that for a while. What else did I need? 
Okay. okay. Excuse me. Okay. For this. I needed mana glass paints. Okay. Have the mirrored glass. Okay. Okay. So I just need a lot of mana glass paints. So once I have the... I need a diluted, so I need light blue dye. Elite induction provider. This is the one I wanted to redo. <clears throat> okay. So this is not what I'm trying to do. Okay, <laughs> let, let's take a step back here. Calm down. Nope, that's also not what I'm trying to do. Okay. Blue orchid, light blue shimmering mushroom. Okay, so basically I need just some... Why well, just make white blue dye? Okay, let's see if this works. Blue <clears throat> orchid, okay. Blue hydrangea, let's see the uses of blue hydrangea. Elite. Light blue dye, perfect. Exactly. I only have two. Dang it. Four. I think that's enough. We're good to go. Good, Good to go! go. Okay. okay. Fabulous mana pool. Induction oh, provider. Fabulous mana Induction pool. cell. Okay. Oh my god. <clears throat> Light gray petal block. Just need a whole bunch of gray petals. Tall mystical gray flower. Uh, okay, we only have one. Hmm. Light gray shimmering mushroom is what I need. Let's go to the twilight portal and find some light gray shimmering mushrooms. Are the shimmering mushrooms in the twilight or are they in the twilight forest over here? Shimmering mushrooms are in the twilight forest. They're next to trees. They're like pinkish, purplish, really noticeable glowing mushrooms. I need light gray ones. Those are vishrooms. I get nausea really Elite easily. Elite induction cell. Elite induction cell. I'm not sure. They might be in the twilight. Seeing any? Yes. Flowers. Ah, oh, the mystical flowers. I really wish we had that equivalent exchange thing that I used to work with. Elite induction. Just take this one that we have. Advanced. Turn it into as many as I need. Flowers would not be expensive. Why did it make four of these now? Um. Mm-hmm. brown flower. Okay. So there are our mystical flowers here. I just the gray ones. Before it gets too terribly dark. 
I'm glad, I'm glad we, we did Twilight, Twilight before we got, we got super OP. Yeah. We would have been bored. Yeah, we would have. Uh, the jetpack would have made everything kind of pointless. Mystical light gray flower. I found one. There's really no more in the area. It was one lone. Oh, two. Two mystical light gray flowers. I like it. Oh, three. Ooh. Can we go? Oh my god, I've made 32 of them. So something's getting stuck. Were you not supposed to make 32 of them? Oh god, no. Oh, maybe. Basics. Okay, let's go back here. Check out how this is coming. Hope I'm doing this right. I'm gonna make it daytime. Yeah? Yeah. All these creepers. See, like, they're not messing up my world. That's not my life. Okay. 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 You're living big flower. I hope you're doing what you're supposed to. Oh. supposed to be stone, isn't it? Man! You need to be reading this more carefully. Uh, Y'all should probably stop watching. <laughs> Why did I just like fall through the world? Oh, I don't want to mess up your crafting. I just need to get some stone. Here, first stone in this. Uh, a little bit to the left. No, to the turn slowly to the left. Slowly to the left more. And then down, and then there in the bottom right corner. Alright, you. Okay. Let's go back. Stone down. We'll be making business. Hopefully. Burns my silk touch. Go. All right. Leave that for a second. Go back. Hunt more flowers. Because you know, that's the kind of content people come for. You know. Um. I am finding mystical gray flowers, though. I am being successful. So, at least there's that. Tasks. Ish. The brown ones are so much easier to see. Why do I get nauseous? Have you not been dealing with that? What? Is your character getting nauseous when you sprint? No. What am I doing wrong? I don't know. <clears throat> Um, flowers. Oh, I'm not in the toilet first anymore. Oh, uh, nauseous from your nutrition. Rub the tum tum is on my stream. Hit N. Are you starving on anything? No, no, no? I'm good. You're 100%. I've been eating chimichangas. 
Yeah, I figured we... That's it's whenever I sprint. That's so weird. Like, your character gets nauseous? But only sometimes, but yeah, for like five seconds I get nauseous. That's weird. I don't know, maybe it, it's like, so that we don't abuse the mechanic. No, maybe it's something in the Twilight Forest then, because I wasn't even using the sprint just now and I got nauseous. Maybe there's something in the Twilight Forest that's making me nauseous. <clears throat> hmm. I think it's these vis. Oh, I think it's the vis rooms. They're when you walk on. Oh yeah, they're poisonous. I didn't know that. Oh, sorry. <laughs> and I kept sprinting over them, so I thought it was the sprinting that was causing it. Oh, she's running. You're running over the poisonous mushrooms. That's yes. that's that's great. I was like, why am I getting nauseous when I'm sprinting? And like, you weren't saying, like, oh, yeah, that happens. So I was yeah, like, no, I'm, why I'm isn't he... trying really hard to understand the pattern, you know, so... Yeah, yeah me too. too. Um, I just got a rotten egg, so hopefully we'll get another crack. Elite induction cell. Hmm... Basic. The gray ones are like the hardest ones to Advanced. find. I think I know what I did wrong. Um. Basic. Basic induction cell. Um, still in the magical forest. Basic, basic induction nope. cell. Nope. Mushroom. Oh, because this one has energy in it. Mushroom. Okay, tablet. Let me see if there's a better way to get this. Okay. Okay. Bone meal. Oh, bone meal's easy to make, right? We have a lot of bones, right? Uh, yeah, we have a lot of bone meal as well. Okay, then... I'm gonna do that instead. Cool, cool. How do I look that up? It does make that easier. You said we have bone meal? Yes. Cool, thank you. Yep. Let's clear some of this out. Um, I'm loading my quest book. Um, okay, so basic induction cell. Okay, washing table on a stick. Basic energy cube. Two. I'm gonna take these tablets out. I'm gonna put a real tablet in. And then the basic oh, energy. Some meal. Oh, one more. I have to make one. There we go. I'm gonna remove you. Oh, and I'm gonna put in the real one. That makes that one. The basic induction cell. Now the advanced. Advanced induction cell. Okay, cool. So. We're doing pretty good whenever I'm gonna take I the tablets out. What am I doing wrong? I'm gonna take the basic induction cells out, put a real one in. Well, I hope you're ready. I need adjacent wooden stone blocks you know, on the next page in there. And advanced blocks. energy. It can be used for crafting. Just give it a minute or so. It just says just give it a minute or so. Take you think I need out. to be in a certain biome for it to for your daisies to turn? I have to do this real quick. 
Well, uh, Sorry. I can't concentrate on two things at once. Like this is costing a lot of resources. I understand. Advanced and then elite. Huh. Between wood and stone. It's elite induction cell. I'm gonna take out the tablets. And then I'm gonna take out the advanced and put the real one in. And then I'm gonna take out the elite and put the real one in. And that should be get me the elite induction cell. Okay, I'll see if that works. I made it look exactly like a picture. Elite induction it say cell. About a specific location, but hopefully. <sighs> Okay, let me make sure I have everything. It doesn't need to craft 16, it's got 32 of them. Still have a rock crystal, right? Couple rock crystals, cool. Need more. Oh, oh my gosh. Wow. The everlasting oh. pool has to be crafted on an ultimate crafting table. It is a one. Yeah, a nine by nine crafting table. Jesus. Where do you get shimmer rock? Bifrost block, rod of the Bifrost, Alf glass, Elven trade. Oh my gosh! Elite induction cell. And okay, finally, I cleaned up the patterns. I finally Dragon have what I was looking for. Okay, what was your question again about astral sorcery? Um, I'm trying to make this pure daisy turn. The stone into living. Put the, the pure daisy down in the ground. Like that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's you, not working. You have to do. You have to have one element. You can't mix and match it. Oh, that's how it is in the book, and I already tried just having one. It's a pure daisy. Yep. Yep. Oh, hello, sir. Yep. Pure daisy. I just made it. Freshly made. S try surrounding it in one uh, just wood. I've never, so, yeah, I know. I've never done it like that. Try surrounding it in just wood or so, just stone. So I need the stone. I had it for like a long time surrounded in just stone. It might be the biome then. Oh, okay. okay. I don't know. Because you put a pure daisy down, you surround it. It takes a little bit of time. Oh, you're on sand. No, I put down dirt right there. But it's not grass. It doesn't have water and stuff. Like if you if you put, I think it has to be put down on grass. Okay. Tear it back. All right. I will do that in my twilight area. All right. And the I'm gonna while I'm here, I'm gonna pull out the. Ultimate induction. This just feels like the right place to be putting down a pure daisy. Okay, so hopefully that'll work. So you've worked with these before? Yes. Okay, so that, that is all I have to do, right? It, that's the, what it's supposed to be. And then just wait. Induction cell. I'll remove this one. Because this one's going to be wrong. I have everything to make my mana pool. Two light gray petal blocks. Hopefully four living rocks soon. Three light blue dye, living rock. Okay. So then I put glass into a mana pool and it becomes mana glass. Now question about the actual 
and a pool. Do I just put water into it, you think? No, the mana pool you have to you have to make a mana spreader. And you have to you you have to make the flowers that give mana to the mana spreader, and then the mana spreader puts mana inside the mana pool, and then when it fills up, then you toss the items in. Thank you. Yep. Well, that's a whole other thing. Cool. Yeah, it's not. So I do need wood. Glimmering living wood. So I need glowstone. I have glowstone. I've got illumination powder. And a lime petal block. So let's see if I can find a lime shimmering mushroom or mystical lime petal. So living wood. Have you checked the ME system? I have a bunch of flowers in there. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll check it first. And I also need to check it for, what was the other thing? What was the other thing? Just that, I guess. Lime. Mystical lime flower. Nice. Okay. So, crafting table on a stick. Let's make a mystical lime block. Got it. Okay. Living wood. So I might go make another petal. And then let me make sure I've got some of that perfect illumination powder. So actually, I can make that. And so then, mana spreader, what uh, flowers? Uh, I would I would recommend making an endo flame. How do you spell that? E n d o f l a m e. Endo flame. Okay, so two brown, one gray, and a red. Brown, one gray, and a. Which one? The red. provider. Elite induction cell. Green mushroom. Oh, no. Whoa. There it is. Mystical red flower. Um, okay. So the cell. Oh, I know, I'm pretty sure it doesn't matter, but the Red. cell takes energy. Um, okay, so let's go to our... Yeah, the cell right here. takes oh, the energy. Water. Elite induction cell. And then the provider gives the energy. Let's get water from the sink, right? Yes. Oh, well, and then put the glass in. Okay. Oh. So cool. it Particle. is two browns, Particles. a gray, and a red. And cryo flux duct. Boom. Infinite RF. Electric magic. E. So. Where is it? There it is. Okay. okay. So you reactor. Flower? Reactor. You made the end of flame? Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, and then you have to make a mana spreader. I'm also, I'm pretty sure you're gonna have to move some grass over there. I'm just I'm gonna just have stuff why is it the... still not doing it? Um, I don't know. It's a. Did you follow the uh, the the lexic of Botania the way? Like in order? 
Yeah. Yeah. It, it doesn't, doesn't have, have like, like um, stuff, stuff to complete the same way, way though. But did you make this book yourself, or did you pull it out of the? I made system? it myself. How did you make the pure daisy? With, With the petal apothecary. And you made the petal apothecary yourself? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Pure daisy like this. That's weird. I agree. I'm going to see if it turns wood. Leave that for a second. So, oh, got my end of flame. What was it called? Mana spreader. Spreader. So oh, yeah, I need living wood. Okay. Let me organize my inventory a bit. Sorry, my computer just started trying to mess up. Okay. Oh, try uh, reinforced stone and infused wood. You get the wood by dropping regular wood in liquid starlight. Yeah, I knew what infused wood is. I think I have And I'm spawning. pretty sure the reinforced stone is a crafting recipe. But that's not what's in the picture. Yeah, well, we're on an expert mod pack. Let me check real quick. What are you? Tr you're trying to make living wood, right? Living wood and living rock, yeah. That seems silly that they wouldn't change the Batania book, though, you know? Oh, no, all the, the Batania book. Yeah, infused wood. It has to be infused wood. So throw your wood into the liquid starlight. Yeah, uh, the, mod, the people on the internet said check the mod pack, or JEI. Check JEI, you know, uh, for updated recipes. Living rock. Living rock is pretty though. What do I need for living Arc rock? Arcane stone. An arcane stone is st stone surrounded by any V crystal from Thaumcraft. Do you have V crystals? Yeah, they're in the ME system. I'm trying to set up the finishing touch on the induction uh, matrix so that you can hit the power button. Uh, yeah. ah, oh my gosh, I forgot that was happening. I'll take your V crystals that are... Oh, now I need to set that to output. Okay. Stone. Surrounding a this crystal gives me arcane stone energy. Sleep. Go back. It's a wicked lag in this area. Living wood, yay! Okay. okay. And then let me see if this one works. So infinite, infinite in, no problem. Okay. Infinite in, no problem. Living wood means I can Infinite make... out can't happen because the advanced power cell can only take 100 RF in, but per face. The ender IO, I really hope this works. Stone, so I need two of those. And Dryo does not want to connect to it. Oh no, can nothing connect to Flux Duct?
Okay, I got, okay, I got a mana spreader. spreader. Come on. Come on. Sorry, my computer is not recognizing my sound. Cool, so it's really not gonna... It's really not working. What's not working? Oh, your speakers decided to stop working? Yeah, and it's like not letting me play. Is it working now? Okay. It's not blocking the game anymore, but it's making notification sounds, which is going to be in the recording. Well, I just made I made a full stack of end game ender IO conduits that aren't working, so where'd all my stone just go? Resonant. Let's see if Lux Doct can connect to or Okay. Okay, this works. It's just going to be half of what I was expecting. Mana, mana spreader. spreader. Which I will put by my mana, mana pool. pool. Yes, yes. living rock, light like gray petal blocks, rust crystal. crystal. So, so I need five living rock and three. Yay, diluted mana pool, and then four. Such a shitty cable. For the regular mana pool, I need my two, my rock crystal, and four. A vivid wave. Please connect. Yes, there we go. Let me use this one. 128,000, so, okay. One, there we go. two, perfect. I need one more living rock. Three, four. Okay. Five. That's the last thing I needed. I grew a metal block, living rock, diluted mana, rock crystal. That's what I have, and of course, it's not showing it. Perfect. I'm loving it. Side input. Let's try it on here. No! It does not say to do it on here. Let's go one more. This. Oh, good start. It says on a crafting table. Oh, that's a white one. Perfect. Of course. Got it. Okay. 
Alright, I am gonna move this stuff actually back up to where my horn was though, so that So we did I give all my stuff together. Okay. Astral Starlight. Let's go. Okay, so I'm going to put my... Mana Spreader. Right here. My Mana Pool. Right there. I'm going to put my... So where do I need to put my Endoflame in comparison to my Mana Spreader? It needs to be pretty close. On grass? Yeah, at least I think so. Did you did you just make uh, living rock and living wood on uh, sand? No. No. Uh, did you make your twig, living wood twig? No. You have to make, that's like your little configurator wand. Okay, configuration. Oh, okay. Cool, I need one more living. Energy, let's see if I can... Here. None. Let's see if I can do this. None. I think it's still gonna work. None. None. My pool of starlight right behind my starlight well. Uh, some more. I don't have any more logs, do I? Okay. This is crazy. I got a lot of stuff on me. Okay. Twig. And then I'm gonna get my mana pool going. And then, what's next? Regular glass, that's what I need. Do we have regular glass? We should. Yep. Cool. Well, so I can make the living wood and living rock here. Cool. Okay, got my twig. What do I do with it? Uh, you have to... you're holding it? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, click on the mana spreader, and then click on your mana pool. Uh, let's see, can you... let... let hi, Leia. Sh hold down shift, right click the mana spreader. Oh. Try place, uh, placing a block under it and then placing the mana spreader a little higher. Oh, uh, gotcha. gotcha, okay. It needs to be above so it can pour. Yeah, like you end up like linking it and it points it downward. Yeah, put it on there. And then get rid of the block. Huh. So it's flying in midair. And now use your wand. Do you hold down shift then right click? Oh, oh, nice. Doesn't do anything. It's a living wood twig. Oh, you didn't make it a wand yet. You need two petals. Oh. oh. <laughs> you're you're just. Said, did you make your twig? Sorry, it's a uh, living wood wand. Say wand living wood. Just yeah, two. It's it's three sticks and two petals. Oh, three twigs. Yeah. Okay. 
and then two petals of your choosing because you can choose what colors you want your two colors i did colors purple I purple and magenta so infinite will come out and then one two oh, three four five sides that's 500k going into one two three four five sides Cyan. that's 500k in i guess it should work cyan and magenta i think is what i want Okay. What's the shape? What's like the uh three like, like that? that, yeah. The, the, those are the colors you wanted, right? Uh -huh. Okay, cool. Now it should work. Oh, oh hey, since you don't have enough experience, I'm ready to uh, start the reactor. Oh, oh. Where, do, where I do I go? Come over, yeah, like right oh, there. My stream hasn't seen this. this. That's right. This so we're ready. You started building. We're ready to, then, uh, to wow. light up the reactor. Ooh. Ah. What's this? What's this? this big stone? I made the nuclear craft reactor out of smooth stone to see like where it's going to sit. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. 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 Yeah. Okay. okay. Um, should, should I flip, flip it? it? No. Okay. okay. <laughs> Give me a second. Whole room, DT fuel 10. You want to stand on that one laser so you can look at it? Yeah, right there. And then... I'm not going to get killed right here. No, right? no. Nah, you're not. Don't worry about it. This is so, so exciting. This is huge, huge, huh? Yeah, this is huge. <laughs> Alrighty. You ready? You wanna yep. you wanna do a countdown? Fifty-nine. Oh god. Fifty-eight. <laughs> 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 five, okay. Five. Four. four three, three. Two. One. Oh fuck. <laughs> cool, huh? Whoa! Up and running. Oh, that's, oh, that's, it, it's, working? it's working? Yeah. That's good? That's good? That's okay. Funny. It's, it's always going to be doing that? that? Yeah. Oh, that's psychedelic, bro. That's, that's so cool. cool. Nice. Deuterium oh 997. Tritium 997. Working? Oh, it's running. Yeah, like the little. The design in the middle means it's running. Cool! Oh, that's, that's so, so cool. cool. I'm gonna go downstairs and check the in induction matrix to see how we're doing on power. Did you, Did you set, set up, up the, the shower thing? again? Uh, no. Where's all the stuff for the shower? Yeah. Yeah. Oh no, I put it back up. Oh, oh put it back up? This can't be right. Using so much experience hopping all over the place. That's a bummer. From from what I understand, the the this reactor only does three hundred and forty thousand RF a tick. Why? Uh, it's just, Wasn't it supposed to do a lot more? I was hoping it was going to do a lot more because the nuclear craft one goes over a million. Huh. It's weird. The output keeps flickering oh, oh. around. Oh. It's shooting beams out. The mana spreader. Oh, yeah. You got to aim it down uh, into the um, mana pool. Yeah, there and now right now right click the mana pool. If you right click, yeah, there you oh! go. Oh, 
Oh, that's cool. So is it getting the stuff from this? You right, uh, shift right click the endo flame, and now right click the mana spreader. And now let's try shift right right clicking the mana uh, mana spreader again. There you go. Now it's linked. See the check mark? Yeah. yeah. On the flower, it's linked, and the mana spreader is linked. Yeah. Cool. Oh, oh this is fancy. fancy. And the endo flame it eats uh, coal blocks of coal. So throw one block of coal at it. Do, do I have coal in then? Yeah, you have to throw a block of oh, coal at it, cool. and then it'll uh, it'll eat it. Okay, so my inventory is kind of ridiculous. So I'm gonna deal with this a little bit. So the the input, like the reactor, is making two hundred. It's lower now. Man, the struggle is I actually need all this stuff. And also, on. where is it outputting it to if it's oh, stopped? It's outputting 1k. Nine nine seven nine nine seven. The fuel is stable so far. Okay, got rid of some of the stuff, but still don't have that much room on me. Oh my goodness. Okay. Five twelve. Five twelve. So, block of coal, so I need to go grab some coal. Five twelve. Five twelve. Why is this one green? So weird. Why is this? Okay. Is a graphical so just error. Just throw one block of coal at it. Yeah, and make sure you don't pick it back up. It just falls on the ground near it, and then it eats it. Yep. You see the little flames on the endo flame. Aww. It's burning the coal now and producing mana, and it's putting the <laughs> the mana into the mana spreader, and the mana spreaders shooting it into the mana pool and uh, it's really really slow uh, so if you want it to be faster you're gonna have to put down a lot more endo flames and throw a lot more coal into it you know what I mean I wonder if that's enough mana like the it would it would have instantly popped out as mana glass oh, oh it made five you made okay cool you got five mana glass you gotta throw a little bit better. <laughs> I don't need this. <laughs> so that's probably why everybody on YouTube is not making the mechanism generator. Everybody's going straight for the nuclear craft one, because the nuclear craft one is kind of busted. Thank you, please. Fuel. It's running. There we go. That was my little side track to make mana glass panes. There we go. Mana glass panes. Now I can go back to my astral tome. Quicksilver, we got glass and aquamarine. We're there. Why is the input going down? Quicksilver. Mirrored glass and aquamarine. Um. Is 
It's just okay. gonna be a little, a little while, while to get here, but we're, we're here. We're, we're making. making. We're finally yeah. making it. The glass, the glass lens. lens. Or, or our looking, looking glass. glass. So sticks, gold, and wood planks. I didn't just get rid of all my wood planks, did I? Dang it! I hate everything. Sticks, gold, and wood planks. It's even about to be night time. Go ahead and make that. Okay, so I just need some more planks. I'm actually making progress. I'm so excited. Okay. Sticks. Stick, stick. I need We don't have that many planks actually, I'm shocked. We have lots of mineral wood. Okay. Make some sticks. Make them out of iron oh. wood. What did you just do? I, I, sh put I put in... in like, like I went... I went like I went... Like I went. Okay, can you put this out here? I put in... Like, like this, this and, and then I shift clicked, it, it pulled, pulled the mineral, mineral wood out and made 64 sticks. Yeah. We don't have any sticks in there? I didn't even check, I was just gonna make a couple. Oh. I was planning on making 64. I didn't know it would yeah, just toss out. them back into the thing. Um, All of the recipes are set for iron wood to turn into planks to turn into sticks. Gotcha. Okay, sticks, planks. Let's go. Let's make this. Um, looking glass. Two sticks, golden planks. Okay. Can't I like imagine this? Two sticks, gold, planks, glass. Ah! Cause I did it. I did it. I did it. All right. Looking, Looking glass! glass! Yay! <laughs> Finally! <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, if I want to make a sextant, I need more quicksilver. Quicksilver? Take all 20 of those. Okay. Um, let's make more of those. Wow, did not mean to do that. Glass panes. Oh, come on, bro. Don't be a douchebag. Okay. Hello, Hello cow. cow. <laughs> A cow, cow just came, came up, up on my... Oh, my uh, man. It's just standing there? Yeah, he, he just walked, walked up and is hanging out. out. That's, That's awesome. awesome. What a freak. He has some beef, beef some, some Angus, Angus beef. beef. Okay. okay. So two, and then sticks along the bottom. the bottom, got it. Sticks along the bottom. So yeah, like it's, it's, yeah. looks like the reactor's only producing 180,000 RF a tick. Is that, so that's a lot worse than your... It's a lot, it's a lot better than what I've been doing so far, but it's not like, I was expecting it to be like really cool. Uh -huh. It's storing a lot of energy, though. It looks really cool. 
Plus, if that makes me feel better. Plus, I mean, like, it's it's funny. The induction matrix can hold 25.6 giga RF. You know, so what is that? Giga RF. Wow. wow. That's, that's, that's pretty intense. Okay. okay. I'm totally done with exploration. I did it finally. Good job. Gosh, okay, now I'm gonna make my telescope. I was just expecting the reactor to do a lot more power than this. This cow is so funny to me. The fact that he is just hanging out. <clears throat> We friends right now. <coughs> A little bit longer. Oh, oh what's, what's that? that? Oh, oh. Telescope. Okay, so we're just gonna set up my telescope. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, I've gotta find the coolest place to set it up. I think next to my light wall would be a good place, right? Oh, oh my gosh, gosh look. look! Nice. Looks oh, cool. Oh, I accidentally just grew. 997, 997. Okay, good. Away. <laughs> I'm gonna telescope! I love it, I'm so excited. <laughs> Okay, okay, telescope, telescope is done. done. Time to move on to my crystal lens. lens. Okay. okay. So I need three, three more. more. Oh, these guys. One, two, three, one, two, three. I might need to make more. Yeah, I need more mana glass panes. So, where's my glass? Let's see, slabs. I need to turn it into panes. Okay. Uh oh, morning is coming. I worked all night for the first time, too. I'm testing the night time real quick to see uh, how the reactors will do overnight. Because I need to work at night, so okay, good. hopefully we'll be able to work at night some too. That would be taco taco. Okay. Here we go. One, one two, three. Oh, two aquamarines. Just wood, a gold, and two rune marbles. Dang it. Uh, crap. Engraved. And ruined. No, I barely, barely, barely ran, ran out of power. power. Oh like, are you talking about arcane power? Um, the um, light. light. Starlight? Starlight. Like, if, if you want to look at mine really fast, when I put the thing, so at night time, yeah. it's all the way here, right? When I put the, when I finished the recipe, uh, it was like right here. Uh, like right underneath it. It's the cow's fault. It was the, the cow's, cow's fault. fault! Why is he ah! there? I, I, I shouldn't have angry killed my cow. He was my friend. <laughs> I, feel I feel bad about it now. 
I miss him. Or Angus. Angus. I can't even pick up his beef. Because you're you're overburdened. I'm a lot. A lot right now. I mean, I solved. It still solves our energy problems. You're just not as excited about it as you thought you. I was just really hoping that it was gonna be like. A, mil a, a solid million. Yeah. I feel you, bro. I mean, it is making more energy than the best power cables can even transfer. You, you know, like all of the cable, like the best cable that I know of, is the mechanism cable, and it can transfer a hundred and twenty-five thousand RF a tick. You know. So the. Uh, Having more wouldn't necessarily be useful yet. Well, I'm, I'm just saying, like, the, the, um, the reactor's doing 180,000 RF a tick. So that's more than the, uh, fastest mechanism cable. So it makes sense, you know? Because you can't, I guess, uh, well, I guess you could have more uh, ports and pull more, you know, more cables, put more cables into the unit if you make more ports. I guess you could do that. But I'm using uh, that cryo-stabilized flux duct that I was so proud of. I mean, it still looks nice. You know, it's symmetrical and everything. Yeah, it looks awesome. I think the inside looks really cool. Okay, I think what I need to do right now is go rock crystal hunt. You remember how to do that? Not really. So I remember at night it just showed me that there's stuff down here. So if I start digging down, will I be able to find some? Yeah. That was where the... where it... Was glowing. Yeah. When you were holding your. My best guess at, at nighttime. Night it doesn't show it at daytime. Oh okay. Yeah, you can always you know vein down and then vein miner. That's, That's true. true. And, and it'll open, open everything up, and I'll be able to see it all. Yeah. Aloe vera. I made the sextant and I didn't even read what it was for. I should probably stop doing that. No. Yeah, I'll make a make little mine down here. Yeah. Porches then? Can you, Can you tell me when it's night time and I'll come back up? Okay. I need to make stuff. So I mean like what's funny is uh so it's inputting at 180,000 RF a tick. Okay. But I'm I can out of the matrix I can only pull uh 1,000 RF a tick because uh I'm feeding it into a uh power cell so that I have wireless power. And uh, because I have five faces of the power cell in use, uh, the power, the output is fluctuating really pretty, pretty hardcore. Mm -hmm. But it'll still work well, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that like the power cell, like I don't understand why it's, it's flickering, like how much power is being pulled uh, because the power cell itself is full. So. Mm -hmm. You know, like, how can there be a power throughput if I have everything off? Uh, so, out. Power you. And then I'll power the void arm miner. Out. Is it nighttime? Uh, daytime. 
top right corner, like above the circular radar, it says daytime. Right. The energy cube is now full. It does indeed. I mean, like, I shouldn't be complaining. I, so I solved the energy crisis that we had. Yay. And I'm pretty sure the next time we have an energy crisis, uh, I can just make the nuclear craft one. So is the nuclear craft one a lot harder and you don't want to do it, or...? Oh no, I just, uh, the mechanism, it was a quest. So I wanted to do the mechanism quest first. That's a smarter plan. Okay. Cool doing. Drop another. Okay, let's. What color is this? Did you find any rock crystals? No, no but I don't think that... So, so basically, basically what I'm going to do instead is at night time I'm going to look and then I'm going to um, mark them with waypoints so that like I can see like it's straight down from there, you know? Yeah. Okay. Is that ready to go? Okay, so let me read about how to use my telescope now. That's exciting. I'm so happy I have a telescope. Okay. This, that way. Discovering constellations is nearly the same as with the looking glass. A clear view to the night sky without obstruction is required. It's only possible to look at one section of the sky at a time, but rotating the telescopes facing with the arrows on the left and right shifts the field of view. Flying outside the telescope frame or rotating the telescope erases all drawn lines. Hints of new kinds of constellations seen within the telescope now appear that are more dim and further away than the major bright constellations. Attuning to them might not be possible, but there should still be enough starlight to create crystals that focus that light. Attuning yourself should make it easier to track and trace these dim constellations. Okay, dog. I do everything, everything at night. <laughs> Astral sorcery is all at night. Okay. okay. What am I going to go to next? I'm going to make that crystal lens, which I think reading about it was saying that I need to use the. One of the crystals that, um, is at the shrines. Yeah. I think that's what I was saying. Like the big crystal? Yeah, I think so. I'm supposed to fart focus that spotlight. Fart? You're supposed to fart? Yeah, so then I can start doing block transmutation, but I don't know how to tell what I can, what will transmute into each other. Sandstone into redstone. I'm not sure. Well, gaining new knowledge is certainly important. Recording said knowledge to preserve it for others, or possibly another civilization uncovering your remains thousands of years later that want to follow your path is equally important. 
right click or shift right click to write down your knowledge onto an empty scroll or one that already has your writing on it. If only the ancients would have left behind something like this in their shrines. Hmm. Occasionally, shooting stars can be seen falling from above. Recovering whatever is left after impact might be valued to scholars of the star. So I need to keep a lookout for shooting stars. Okay. I'm so excited from here. It's like smooth sailing, you know? Yeah. I need rock crystals, but other than that, okay, reinforced slate. I need a blood altar. Blood altar is blood craft, yes. blood magic. We don't, I haven't even unlocked that yet. So that's the next thing we need to go towards. And then impulsion wand. Conscious the pearls of the wand has only a limited range and pulls its user towards whatever it finds rather than providing an instant teleportation. Okay. Active channeling. But or nothing but maybe a small flashlight with some properties to start us constructing wands that can channel this energy to produce more order, orderly results should be possible. Tommy and oh, Fortress. Me. It's night time! It's night time. Okay. okay. Oh. Yay! I got three lenses. Okay. Try putting them down and see what happens. Yeah, see, I feel like... Caster's Gauntlet Viz Resonator. Nether quartz and iron plates. Link. Link lens to a block. But I think I need to have light. Yeah. Okay. Make okay. Caster's gauntlet. I'm totally wasting time. Okay. Let's work. Let's try. Three iron. Bye.
You using the darkness right now? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Well, well, I'm not sure. But if we can stay night for a little bit longer, that would be nice. Are you looking for rock crystals? Oh man, I need to mark those really fast. But I am testing something out. It looks like our fuel is not going down. So at least it's running stable. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I think I did it. I think I did it. I think I did it. Cool. I right, let me go, go mark. mark these places like that. You found some spots? Like, like I linked. Oh. Okay. okay. Anyway. anyway. Huh. Let's see. Wireless terminal. The cockatrice is so loud. It's daytime again. Thank, Thank you for letting me use tonight. the night. I marked six oh. spots where our crystal stuff is shooting out. Cool. So I can go now and try to do that while it's nighttime. Check on my iron there and see if that works. Turning it into Zanusta. Uh, Astro Crystal. It's 
like smoking and stuff and acting like it's going to do something. It didn't actually do something. It's supposed to transmute. But it is not transmuting. I don't know how to get it to We are at block and have streamed this two hours without even thinking about stopping. That's true. I think this is where I'm going to end my episode. Staring at some iron, wishing that it would turn to stardust. Well, thanks for watching. See y'all. See y'all next time. It's been, been a blast. blast. This, this has been Trimpin' and Abyss Gaming. So, T-A-G, tag your it. Go like, comment, subscribe. That. Bye. Anyway, mining. Lag. Hard. Hard lag. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, that scared, scared, scared the crap, crap out of me. I'm in, in the, the waypoint, waypoint. So, all so all of a sudden everything, everything turned green. Like, look what this looked like. Oh, weird. It scared the crap out of me. I was like, what did I do? What's the uh, seeing the X's on the ground thing? Uh, F6. Trying to build a wireless crafting terminal. I think I, well, came out to, oh cool, this is all lit up by our cave illuminator. Yeah, nice. Well, do you think this is rock crystals down here?
Uh, those are V crystals. I know, Ooh. but you'll have is... to keep looking. So it's not related at all. No. Those you just have to where... keep going. Yeah, just keep vein mining. You don't need V crystals? No, I have more than enough. Well, I made a wireless crafting terminal, but uh, I don't know how to charge it. And honestly, I'm a little tired, so I'm probably gonna log off. I'll leave it at that. So let me go look at the uh, fusion reactor real quick, see if it's still running. Fuel, still running. Let's see how much power we have already. We already have 9.85 uh, giga RF stored. That's working pretty well. And now, now it's fluctuating at an output of 11,000 RF a tick. Hmm. Hmm. And everything's still full. All right, so I'm going to call my stream on that. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and tune in next time.